This bulk mock-up creation strategy is going to save you not only money, but hours and hours of your time. What's up everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Dave, if you're new here, please consider subscribing. I do new videos on Etsy success all the time. In this video, we're gonna talk about the print-on-demand app known as My Designs. So using what I'm about to show you, you are able to stop paying for place it, get your own mockups, upload them to my designs and create them in bulk. I'm talking hundreds at a time, as many as you can handle at a time. And if you purchase mockups in bulk, then you will never need to use place it again, thus saving you $29 a month. And most importantly, hours and hours and hours of your time spent on place it. Let's jump into it. So here we are in the My Designs dashboard. You want to log in, obviously, and then click mockups here on the side. We're going to hit upload mockup, and this is where you upload your mockup. That's where you're going to do it. However, we need to go over the process first. Now, typically, when you buy mockup packs, they're like, for example, on Etsy, a lot of them are just images of people wearing blank clothing. Great. What you want to look out for is if you want to skip the entire process I'm about to show you to create your own mockup within Photoshop, you want to buy PSD mockups ready to go. Then what you would do is come to a mockup like this and at the bottom here, just rename the layer MD-Design. That's what my designs is looking for. A, a smart object layer has to be a smart object layer named md-design all right so that's the the cream of the crop here that's the that's the magic sauce that you're looking for any mock-up that you buy is is going to need that all right so even if you buy a psd mock-up you're going to want to name the design file or the design layer sorry um, md-design and it needs to be a smart object layer but let's say you just bought a giant pack of mock-ups right I want to walk you through this entire process um, as if you are just fresh, just bought a giant pack of mock-ups and you're ready to break up with place it. All right. So let's say that this design here is a, a, a this is one I bought off of Etsy and it, it is not a PSD mock-up. It was just a, it was just a JPEG image. So you, you open it in Photoshop. If you don't have Photoshop, you can use photo P it's an online free alternative that has the most basic features of Photoshop, including layer creation and all that stuff. That's what you're going to need to do. And when you up upload your markup, keep in mind, it does have to be a .psd file and photo P can do that. So whether you're in Photoshop or photo P, this is going to be the same process. Okay. Let's say you uploaded your, you opened your mockup photo that you bought here. So now you want to go over to my designs. Um, grab this over here, hit, hit video training, go to the how to create custom mockups for my designs and download this right here. It's just a placeholder image. It's essentially the same ratio as the 4,500 by 54 pixels that my design wants your designs to be. Um, when you upload them, it's just the easiest that way. They don't have to be when you upload a design. Um, but you'll find that when you upload a design that is 45 by 50, 45 by 5400 pixels, you don't have to like move it around. You can move it around within my designs. All that is possible, but it just streamlines the process. And if you want to be like, boom, bam, bim, quick, then that's how you want to do it. Okay. So you download this right here, save image as, then go back over to your image here in Photoshop. Um, I'm going to grab it out of my downloads here and go like this boom and now now it's on here as a layer okay now you just place it where you want to like that okay that looks good for now i'm gonna go quick so let's just leave it there now come down here name this new na rename come on double click rename it uh, MD dash designs. Boom. Now convert to smart object. Boom. Okay. Now we're good to go. You hit save. It's already saved. I just hit save. 
So now I'm going to go back over to my designs, hit upload mockup, choose mockup. These are all the other things, but the most crucial one is design. The layer, PSD layer name must be MD-design. All this other stuff is super, super advanced, um, and we can get into that in another video, but this video is specifically for showing you how to kind of bypass the need for place it. So hit choose mockup. Here's the test.psd, that's what I named it, test.psd. Open it up. Wait a couple seconds while this uploads, and I'll show you in a second making a mock-up with the new mock-up. Oops, what? I messed up. Right here. Oh, okay. I named it md-designs. It needs to be md-design. Sorry. Okay, saved. Boom. Boom, boom, wait a couple more seconds with me. So to, to summarize, you open your image in Photoshop. You add that image from this page here in the video training from create custom mockups for my designs, download this, or what you could do is make your own 4,500 by 54 pixels image and then literally just drag that onto um onto your image here. Then name it MD-Design, make sure it's a smart object, you're good to go from there. If you wanna get super advanced, you can apply distortion like a, like a, um, to make it fit the, the crinkles of the shirt or something to that effect. Um, but for all intensive purposes, extensive purposes, however you uh, say that, we're gonna just do it this way right now. Hit upload mockup, it, it says that it, it found the layer right here. Upload mock-up again, and we're rocking. Well, I'll wait another couple seconds there, and it'll show us the summary once again, a little more extensive summary. Here it is. Awesome. Cool. You don't need to touch any of this. Hit Save Changes. Now, um, this they're going to stay here too. You can come to mock-ups, and you'll be able to see all your mock-ups. Um, now check this out. We're gonna make a we're gonna make a mock-up with the mock-up I just created. So I'm gonna hit listings. Here's one of my my designs. I have it checked here. Always make sure it's checked if you want to create a mock-up. Hit more actions. Hit mock-ups. Then while it's loading here, we got we can do we want to do this drop-down menu right here. Go to my mock-ups. You'll see it right here. I click that. Boom. Now you choose your file mockup slot like all that like before. Now hit generate preview and you're going to see that design of mine show up right here on the mockup I just made. So this design and this mockup, I bought this mockup off of Etsy. It was not ready to go. I made it ready to go. This design I made. So I just made everything good to go within my designs without place it. Okay, so that and if you were to do this, you know, keep in mind, if I wanted to put all these designs, you know, if I had 100 designs in here, I could put 100 designs on that one mock-up all at once. So that's a huge, huge bulk creation tool. The, the same process for one design is the same for, for many. So if I selected all here, it would put all these designs on that one mock-up. So when I do upload and push them over to Etsy, it would show up for every single mockup and every that mockup would show up on every single one of these listings. So it's extremely powerful. So what you so my my strategy here, your 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 homework, if you want to bypass place it and save hours of your time, is to buy a pack off of Etsy. Please don't buy that one that everybody uses that like that one chick that I swear I every print on demand store, I swear there's like a requirement for people to use that lady for the mock-ups. I don't know if you know, what, if you know, you know, but please don't use that one. Um, you could, if you wanted to, but get a, a pack off of Etsy or pack off somewhere else, then complete that process that I just showed you with Photoshop. Gotta be a smart object layer. Gotta be called MD dash design, save it as a PSD upload to mockups and you're saving $29 a month because you don't need to do place it and then you are making mockups in bulk which place it does not have 
So you have a ton more control and you can save a ton more time. If you want to try my designs, the link is in the description. You can help support the channel. If you have any questions for me, please feel free to post them in the comments. I'll answer them. Um, and until next time, have a beautiful day.